Yeah. Well, are you aware of the upcoming tournament? Yeah, I really don't think there is. What are you two rumbling about? The Writers' Cup. I so wish to be chosen. I think we'd know who'd win. Of course I would. I suppose we'll find out tomorrow. Obviously I would. I'm the smartest one here. You guys haven't been to Harvard twice. Oh, Oliver, just because you're a college graduate doesn't make you any better than me. An emotional writer would also win. Correct me if I'm wrong, but people want to know about my experiences as a traveler. Well, I think we can all agree that my experiences are far more interesting. A poem about life struggle will surely win the people's hearts. What is the prize for the winner anyway? A load of fortune, a guaranteed and advertised and published book, and fame. Man, I really need to win. You know, Edgar from Southern will be a threat too. You should be more worried about me, not that stupid Edgar. I'm going to bed. Sleep with one eye open, you peasants. Good night, lunatic. Okay, bye! Adios, amigos. Bye. Man, I'm so excited for this quiz match. I am too. We should definitely win today. We have a wonderful chance to win. Slytherin is awful. Don't get ahead of yourself. Edgar knows what he's doing out there. Have fun, boys. See you after the game, Emily. Alright, boys, let's go win today. Alright. Ready, Edgar? Chosen. I know, man. Best of luck to you. <sighs> Same to you. I've been writing a lot recently, you know. About what? Society and how people like Edgar are ruining it. Yeah, Edgar may be a pain, but his poems are pretty impressive. He's got a great chance of winning. I've been writing a lot, too. Anything that's got that's on my mind, I've just been writing about it. I get like that sometimes, too. It's odd. Anyway, it's already 1 o'clock. I should be going to bed. Yeah, good night, Paul. See you tomorrow. See you, Ollie. Welcome to the Writers' Cup. Your five contestants will be competing in one of the most fascinating challenges yet, and whoever wins this challenge will be crowned the Writer Champion. There is a hidden poem book within the tournament field, and whichever author finds it first will be the new poet of the school. First up is Paul Dunbar from Gryffindor. Hello everyone, I'm Paul Dunbar, 18 years of age. I talk about the hardships of African Americans in problems in society. Thank you, Paul. Our next contestant is Edgar Masters. My name is Edgar Masters. I'm 19 years old. I write poetry on the dialects and language. Moving on is Emily Dickinson. I'm Emily Dickinson. I write poems and stories about love, and I usually write in him and meter. Walt Whitman is up next. Hello, I'm Walt Whitman. I write about the hardships of slavery, and I write in imagery and paradox. Our last, our last and final contestant is Oliver Holmes. Going down. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Oliver Holmes, 19, and I specialize in hymns and poetry. Thank you. Let the challenge okay, begin. After a long, hard battle, Paul had found the poem book beneath one of the rocks in the arena. He was then named the new established writer of Hogwarts and had published his first book, Oak and Ivy. Harlem.